What is going on guys? Today we are looking at Team of the Season Fonte. So, 91 rated, 58k I want to say, no, 53k on the Xbox, 54 PlayStation. Um, he was going for around about 35, 37 um, a couple of days ago, but he has gone up um, purely for the fact that 91s are a little bit more expensive. So, personally, I did pick one up myself, um, as well as getting one on tradable as well. Um, just because he was too cheap, like 30 something K for a 91. De Gea was going for around about 50 as well at that point. Um, so, for a 91 outfielder player, even if you're just going to use him in an SBC, was far too cheap. So, I went and picked one up at least. Should have picked a couple up, but I didn't really fancy doing anything unassigned or what have you. Um, but. Not a bad price, 53k for a 91. There is a few bad points to him, obviously. Um, personally, I don't think he's completely, completely unusable. He is usable to some extent, but it depends on what you're looking for. If you've got this team, you've got this god squad, or got a team that's 90 plus everyone, more than likely, he isn't going to make your team. That's just without saying. If you're making a Portuguese team or a Ligue 1 team, He's definitely one that you could stick in there. Um, personally, I wouldn't play him in foot champs if I was you. Uh, but division rivals uh, in squad battles, what have you, he definitely can compete. I think he's not that completely useless. The main things that I like about this card is predominantly all of his defending stats, if anything. He does have 92 defending overall. I think the one thing that definitely takes people away is the 65 pace. And then also, when you del delve de deeper into this, uh, into this player review... 40 stamina for me that like even a push of 60 40 is just not good enough in this in this kind of age of the game with what eight months down or whatever you assume something along them lines there's no way that you can be playing anyone with 40 stamina it just isn't possible he loses stamina so quickly um obviously he still can do the whole game but he just would not be able to run by the end of it. You'll notice quite a lot when it comes to his uh, stamina bar it's just not there whatsoever um but Regardless, there is some really nice points of him. I love his standing tackling. I think that's definitely one of the really nice things about him. He's decent at them last ditch challenges and headers. He is six foot two, which is quite a decent height for a defender. High defensive work rate, medium attacking. Again, I I'd be quite happy with that. Strength wise, he's got 98 with 99 aggression. Short pass is 95 as well, just a little standout one. And then he also does have 94 reactions as well. So. He's got a few points, and like, I, like I'm showing you in the pros and cons now, standing tackle, positioning, and strength were definitely his pros of this card, but then pace and stamina definitely come down under the cons area. So, whether I think personally they, the cons do outweigh the, the whole, whole entire card, and that is why he's only a 5 out of 10, which is probably one of the lowest rated team of the seasons I've done so far. But with the meta of this game... There is just no way that you can deal with this centre-back in foot champs. I've put him as a super sub. To be honest, I probably should have put him as a, a potential reserve player. Um, probably not even a super sub. So just scratch that out. It will be like a, a reserve player or even potentially just a club filler, if anything. Um, I think he's a good card to have in your club. SBC-wise, is fantastic. If the, if the ultimate team of the season do require a, like, say, two or three informs, um, in team of the seasons anyway, um, and say, like, an 88-rated squad, then more than likely this card will more than likely bump up in price. And I think that is predominantly what he's going to be used for. I don't think really a met, you'll see many people with this, this card at all, unless, like I said, they've got a league on budget squad or they've got a Portuguese squad and even then I could probably think of a couple of others that definitely could go over him to be honest so anyway I thought I'd do him definitely let him know uh, see what he's like I want to try and get as many team of the seasons done before the end and then obviously we're going to try and fill in on the ultimate team of the season week anyone that we haven't done and then to be honest I don't know where we're going from there but we'll see footies will be around the corner um, so hopefully you enjoyed let me know if, what you think of Fonte have you packed him is he your SVC player? Is that what you're going to use him for? Apart from that, if you did enjoy, a little cheeky like on the video is always fantastic. And if you want to subscribe, if you're new around here with the bell button on, that is always, again, fantastic as well. So hopefully you enjoyed, and I'll see you all for the next one. Peace.